Welcome back to Tom Talks Gaming. Today we're playing The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD on the Wii U and we're covering Shark Island. This one, if I remember correctly, you have to like hit a number of switches all within a certain amount of time in order to make it into the, I don't know what you call it, a drop hole? This hole that has fire around it. And then uh, do some biting. It's called Shark Island because it's shaped like a shark. So you need to use the hammer here. Yeah, I need to prepare everything else to do before I actually start hitting everything. Looks like there's a switch right there. And then I have to step on this. Oh, at the other side of the island, there's something I needed to do too. Well, I probably need to, how I need to prep this, I think, is I need to clear all these trees and stuff. Maybe not the grass, but the trees. Um, let's see, maybe some bushes. It's a rock. All four switches. Okay, there is a fourth one. I am correct. Last time I played this, it was on the GameCube. Anyway, let's find the fourth switch. I think it's it's not up there, because you can't get up there without the switch. Switch is uh, done, I think. Okay. There we are. There's a... There it is. Need the iron boots for that. Okay. Yeah. In order, to, I'm clearing all these trees right now. That way, um, I can run to the switches without being obstructed. All that di uh, easily unobstructed for the justice. Obstruction justice. Anyway, when you watch the law and order, order that's what the, the the detectives always say. If you don't want to answer a question, you're like you're obstructing, we'll, we'll arrest you on obstruction of justice. I don't know. I read a. Uh, I read a. Uh, online at the Supreme Court that police officers can lie to you. They also recommend not to chit chat with police unless you have a lawyer, I think. I'm just saying what I read online. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. I'll be wrong again. See, once again, back to Zelda, I'm, I'm uh, chopping down these trees to make it easy to run to and fro. So I'll probably use iron boots right here. Well, I have to use iron boots right here. Then I'll hit that switch. I'll step on that other... How do you call that, that, that box? Pedal. Uh, button. I'll step on the button. I forget what they call them. The guides or whatever. I don't really read the guides. Sometimes online if I need help figuring out a game, of course. Or I'll watch a video like the one I'm making right now. And then I'll hammer the nail. Okay, I can't get that. I have to get closer to get that. Okay. Here we go. Okay, take the boots off. Get in range. Okay, as you're walking, save some time. Okay, now we're gonna go up here to this button. Switch. I think it's a switch. Anyway, you step on that, and now we're gonna go over to the, the, the nail to hammer it in. I think it's called a nail. Might as well call it a nail. Call it a nail. I have a hammer. And the fire has gone away from the hole that we're gonna drop into. By the way, I saw a movie recently. Uh, it's called uh, The Professor and the Madman. It's about the creation of the first uh, o Oxford Dictionary, English Oxford Dictionary. Made in 2019, it has uh, Mel Gibson and Sean Penn. It's pretty good, I watched it yesterday. Take my re re recommendations as you will, I'm not a... I'm just a guy talking, I like to play video for your amusement. By the way, like, share, comment, and subscribe if you like this stuff. I appreciate all of you that have been uh, liking and commenting and subscribing. I really Great, yeah. Uh, let me know what kind of content you like based on what I've given you so far. That way I can try to uh, make sure you, the viewer, enjoy as much as possible. Okay, now we're killing the pig face again. Okay, here comes. That's a dark nut right there. Peace. Okay. Kill, kill. Okay. Another good thing on Netflix is, uh,. Show. It's called Queen Gambit. It came out, I think, a couple months ago. I really enjoyed it. If you like chess, that's kind of what it's about. Based on a novel. Anyway. Okay, we're going to defeat the Dark Nut. Oh, more kids are because they, they see these enemies just keep on coming. This is Shark Island, by the way. Yo. Keep on saying kill, that's kind of like, slay. Well, I had a friend who plays Smash Bros. I'm slain. Whatever you got KO'd. Okay. Usually I like to. Uh, Take off, um, the, take the, uh, using my grappling hook to, to, to take the, take the Moblin's necklaces off. 
but we're facing a lot of different enemies right here right now. So, beggars can't be choosers, but choosers can choose to be beggars. Ah, okay, he hit me. There we go, we wait to do the A thing. I don't know what you call that. There we go. And do that in order to take off the armor. Then you can finally burst it off. Sticks and stones and break your bones. Right. The word can never hurt you, but that's what I guess it's like that. I don't know. I think it's Eleanor Roosevelt's and you can only make me angry in order to allow it. Something like that. In fifth grade, uh, we used to listen to the wall that says that and says don't be ordinary, be extra ordinary. The things I did that were sought out in the classrooms as a child. Those were good days, but I like being an adult as well. Okay, they're really knocking the crap out of me. Yeah, this isn't good. This is actually kind of embarrassing. Look, there's a piece keep on coming, man. Here we go. Rat, green rat faces, as I call them. I think they're just called bokoblins or moblins. Or... I'm not sure. They all look different inside each of the games for the most part. Here we go. Took off all that guy's armor except the shield. He has to drop his shield. Okay, here we go. Yes. Here we go. Lord. Bon golly, Miss Mop. Is that the uh, little Richard? My golly, Miss Mullen? Uh, I, I write jokes and stuff. I don't write music or study music. Comedy that I study that and I play video games. Okay. This is a bit. I'm, I'm, I'm a bit sloppy, I'll admit. I'm still kind of slaying, you know, I haven't died yet. Okay, there's a I have to take care of these guys. Wiz robes always get in my way. Okay, we're not actually not in the board yet, I don't think. Here we go. Let's see here. I think we're nearing the finish of this. Okay, I see. I was gonna have to get the armor on. Let's see here. Looks like these are the last of everyone, because they're enemies of stock coming in. And if you get behind these guys, and they don't like you're behind them, put their little red strings and take off the armor to save you some time on having to do the little A counter thing. Let's call it a counter, it's pretty good. That thing right there. You have to call it basically like that. And the A button goes green. Like shocking. We got one more guy here. I forget what we get on this item. Well, we'll see soon enough, right? Yes, kill him with his own sword. It's gotta be insulting somehow. Let's get the chest and then we'll collect all the goodies. Okay, we got a silver rupee worth 200 rupees. I'd say it's worth it. I mean, gotta be positive. Glass half full. Half full. Actually, a glass half full is actually completely full if you count the matter. Because, like, you know, inside, <laughs> inside science, everything is made of matter. All the air, the, there's a mat, all the air is matter. All of our skin cells is matter. Everything is made of matter, so. It's half full of water, but it's completely full of matter as far as the glass goes. Science. Eighth grade science. Some however many years ago. Yeah, it's also, uh, this year, 2021, the office is no longer on Netflix. I think it went to Peacock or something like that. Anyway, I'm gonna do these switches again very quick because, uh, I think there's something I was supposed to get, like, it activated some air, and I want to, uh, get up to the top level. So we're gonna have to clear some trees again. I, I was going to do that before I went down the hole, but I don't want to mess anything up. 
Okay, let's see here. Remember, if you like this video, uh, like, share, comment, subscribe. That's the best way to support the channel. If you would like to support my work further, then the link, there's a link in the description down below to my joke book. It's, uh, it's an ebook you can get on Amazon view with the Kindle app on your smartphone or tablet. It's called Jokes Better Left Unsaid, so I wrote them down. But uh, most of all, the, you don't have to do that. Just like, share, comment, subscribe. I appreciate all the views and all the comments and try to interact with you guys as much as I can and, um, in a timely manner. Anyway, so we're gonna, let's finish this off. We're gonna do this once again. This is a nice little refresher. Get our iron boots. Take them off. Now we're gonna run and we're gonna do that little, uh, that over there. Hit the switch. Hit the nose! Anakin Skywalker. The Phantom Menace. I have to say, I like the Phantom Menace compared to, uh, 7, 8, and 9. Of course, I was in first grade when I saw the Phantom Menace. Star Wars is what I'm talking about, if you couldn't tell. I'm sure most of you could. And if you couldn't, that's okay. See, that's what I need to do the switch for again. Those are switches for Egan. Okay, we're gonna go over here, because it looks like what we need to use this, uh, updraft. Let's call it updraft. That's what they call it in Breath of the Wild to get to the top of this uh, shark island here. Right over there. I should probably change the direction of the wind with the Wind's Requiem, up left right, with the Wind Waker. Wind's, Re wind's Requiem. Okay, we're almost done here. Uh, that way, there we go. Control the winds, my son. Here we are. Okay, we should be able to make it here. Oh yeah, we got plenty of magic. Let's see. Looks like we just get the... Oh, okay, okay, so on here is a blue choo-choo jelly. I think there's gotta be at least 15 of them in this uh, game, that way you can get the, the blue potion from Windfall Island. So always make sure you get the choo-jelly. Remember, like, share, comment, subscribe, and that's it for today. Thanks guys, this is Tom Talks Gaming.